Hello, my name is Billy Manos. <coughs> uh, today is Tuesday, March 24th, 2009. It's uh, 9.38 p.m. Anyway, I'm here to uh, start a series of chapters about my life, just to let you get to know me. Uh, I've had many good things happen and many bad things happen. This may sound like a dumb intro, but this is the first time. So, uh, I was born in Camden, New Jersey. Right now I'm in Van Nuys, California, which I've been for the last 12 years. Uh, the cultural difference is way... I mean, when I was growing up in New Jersey, it was primarily black and white people. Out here, it's white and everybody else. <laughs> uh, not to, you know, I mean, not... It's just a fact. Uh, I never thought I would ever be in a minority, but I am. And uh, it's kind of interesting, though, because I get to learn about different cultures, Korean, Asian, Mexican, of course. Um, it's just amazing. Uh, when I was growing up, it was just, you know, two types of people and wasn't really much interest in life. When I came out here, not a, not only the cultural difference, but it was funny. The first time I ever took a bus out here, uh, back east, if you had a $5 bill, you just give it to the driver and they make change. And I assumed that when I came out here. And um, as soon as I got on the bus, I gave the driver a $5 bill. He said, a gap change only. I was like, what? I knew what a gap change meant, but I didn't know I needed it. Like, uh, shoot, my first time taking a bus, I gotta get off the bus and make change. And, um, so I did. No big deal, but it just surprised me. Um, I grew up with, uh, up until age six or seven, both of my parents. Then, uh, eventually they got divorced due to uh, my dad drinking and stuff. <clears throat> um, it was hard. You know, I didn't understand. I always thought, you know, mom and dad, that's how life is. Then it was only mom. And uh, one time I remember my dad taking me uh, to uh, visit someone. And on the way there, he told me, Billy, you have another brother like, okay, how's that possible? Because I always thought mom and dad, that's the only way I can get a brother or sister. And I knew my mom didn't have anyone else. And uh, I was confused. I was, I think, eight or nine at the time. And he kept insisting I have another brother. And I kept insisting I don't understand how that's possible. <laughs> Eventually he had to tell me, uh, you know, well, he had, well, you know. But, um, uh, like, I still didn't comprehend, but, uh, I do have two older brothers from my both parents, but, uh, they were cool. They were, uh, five and six years older than me. Growing up, they used to tease me. Looking back, I think it's funny, but at the time, I didn't know. They, uh, every time I got a bath, because I was a little kid, uh, they, uh, both of them, they were only born a year apart, and I'm like five or six years behind them. They always kidded around with me, saying, you are adopted. And at the time, I was, I always begged my mom, was I adopted? I mean, I never really knew. And, well, I know now, but, um, it was kind of weird. Another thing about, uh, teaching and stuff, my, growing up, you know, uh, I'm a Christian, well, it has nothing to do with Santa Claus, but I remember my mom always telling me, yeah, Santa Claus is coming tonight on Christmas Eve, and she always left cookies and milk downstairs, we went to bed, and, uh, my friends in elementary school, there is no Santa Claus. Like, yes, there is, my mom says there is, and, uh, it was strange. Who do I believe? My mom? I mean, my very own mom? There is a Santa Claus? 
or my hundreds of friends in elementary school saying there isn't. And finally one day, I uh, just outright said, Mom, I don't know who to believe. I got a hundred friends in school saying there is no Santa Claus, but you're my mom, and you're saying there is. Which is it? And she actually finally told me, there really is not a Santa Claus. Uh, I hope no little tiny kids do this, but, um, and I just thought, wow. Uh, I, underst I understand now, but it, at the time it was devastating. I'm like, oh my gosh, my mom's been lying to me all this time. 